warrior beside us. Nothing else. Not gold, not glory. Back in poor Southeast. You. We're a Siegfried and Toka. Ah, uh, battle must be near. The crow has come for the feast. You have a clever tongue, friend. But tomorrow we all speak in a language older than words. Fate already knows who lives and who dies. Again I ask, where are the others? <sighs> Fetching more catapults for tomorrow's attack. You can wait. I shall wait. Somewhere else. Bloodlust and battle drunk. It is the only time I am alive. Far from home. Before another city of strangers. When did our lives become a saga, Sunan? Yes. I know the day. The very day when mother and father died. Count Odo will not hear reason. Charles plays games. I cannot trust the lives of my people with such men. The Queen now. She I could trust, but she lacks power. My place is here, with Siegfried and Toka, come what may. Eivor, you return! That means all is ready, and we cannot turn back now. Why do you worry? You'll collect more swords. I know how to fight other warriors on the field of battle. This is a city. There will be flames. It matters not. Tomorrow we will fight as warriors, not ruthless killers. As I swear upon my honor. Ah, Eivor the Talker. And to whom have you so freely given your word about how my battle goes? I said it. The gods heard it. That is enough. And if I say we burn this city to ashes and feed the crows with children, what say you? Say what you like, Siegfried, but we are free things, all of us. You're not our Jarl, nor our king. Ha <laughs> ha Good! Good! Keep that fire burning through the night. It shall kindle our vengeance at the break of dawn. Time to go lie on my furs. How do you do that, Eivor? Sleep before a battle, I mean. Easy. I remember my mother's murder. Each moment. Second, I recall every word the old father ever said to me. And finally, I think upon this war-filled world. And of the next. The whole of endless wonder. Only then do I rest. They say Halfdan Ragnar's son is the strongest of Ragnar's sons. Strong he is. Once he took an arrow in the shoulder, he tore it out and shot it right back. He hit that Saxon through the eye of his helm at 300 paces. A true tale. I sometimes. 
sometimes think Redda makes these up each morning just to keep us all busy. Come back any time, my friend! Today, warriors, we shall take that city and sack it and burn it to the ground. And tonight, friends, we shall feast in Odo's palace or in Odin's hall with the choosers of the slain. Now is the time of honor. The hour of our glory! The day of vengeance! the king of glory? The Lord is strong and mighty in battle. He trains my hands for war, so that my arms may hold this cross of gold. I shall not yield! Brave Sif, bring the gift of victory. Odin, lend me your helm of arms. Vida, feed my need for vengeance of Vanir, Oasir, crush these walls. I am the gate of Paris!
gates have fallen! The city is ours! Spare no one! By Sif and Tyr, the day is ours! Fate favors the brave. Now what, Siegfried? Rush the palace gates! We'll bring the whole place crashing down on Odo's skull! To the palace! Fire and vengeance! Faster! Faster! Catch them off guard! Follow me, Pontius! To hell of victory! down. Fall back! Fall back! Damn the gods! I walked right into Odo's trap like a healing elk. Do not lose heart, Siegfried. Battle is a fickle goddess. Uncle, it is worse. The scouts report that warrior priest, uh... Gasling. Yes, he rallies a large force of Franks in the east, in that church. Damn the gods. They will crush us out in the open. What do we do? Our catapults could hit that church, but they have no way to aim. We should light signal fires on the towers. That will give the catapults something to target. Yes, do it. I will get the wounded out and alert the catapults before rejoining you. Good. And I will take down this warrior priest Gaslan before he rallies the Franks. That's 
one tower. Now for number two. Gates are down! Charge! Remember you, the silent jester from the tavern. You have earned my eternal gratitude. I assume you seek the war priest, Goslin? Please, take the church key. It's brought me only trouble. Thanks. It seems you found your tongue after all. Hey! The Northmen have broken through the city gates! 
and run right into our trap. Even now, our warriors scatter for my devastating counterattack. We will crush them between the towers and the walls. We will slay them all and burn their villages. Now, pray with me, good. Join your nailed god in death, as you served him in life. Mama, I'm scared. Clear the hall! Hush, child. Shh, hush. Come, Eivor. The fighting still rages through the streets. We need your strength. Does this end, Toka? Killing everyone? It is as I feared. The bloodlust is upon him. He will slaughter the whole city. If I can reach Count Odo, I can make him surrender to stop this madness. Siegfried's warriors have surrounded the gates to Odo's palace. With Goslan dead, the streets are ours. We are moving the catapults to batter the palace gates down. There must be another way over, under, or around those walls. Nolwen once spoke of a tunnel in the southwest. One way or another, I'll get in. Smuggler, I last saw you in the tunnels. That was before your army started the burning and pillaging. This slaughter is not my doing. I mean to end this. You have not won yet. Charles is marching toward Paris with his heavy horse. Gods, his army comes. Well, this, they are close and riding hard. All the more reason I must hurry and end this thing. I need a hidden way into Odo's palace. I know a way, but there is a band of Frankish warriors milling about. Show me. Upon my honor, I give you my word that Toka and I, we do not want this. Fine. I will lead the way. Chase them off. We will die if we don't get into Odo's palace somehow. There is a tunnel around here. Keep searching, men. Goddamn, you will suffer. Now, 
Eivor. Down into the dark we go. That tunnel takes you into the palais. Thank you, Norwen. And you? I will save what I can of my trade goods and leave through other tunnels. Godspeed, Eva. A safe journey to you, too. A fine haul of Norse war gear and Frankish riches. Looks like Norwin smuggled for both sides. Workers fled, leaving with open and scaffolding everywhere. You can't blame them. I should be home, minding my goats. to cloak myself here. On animal lungs today of all days. We may die today. Should I spend my last moment scrubbing floors or making love? May God have mercy on your soul, Abuda. Sneaking through the back door like that. Who are you and what are you doing? Following that love struck mage lead me into the palace. Stop. Mosher is coming and and he'll lock you up.
when I'm inside the palace. I need to find someone to point me toward Odo. Pardon me, good sirs. Where may I find Count Odo? Count Odo? Who cares about Count Odo? Where is our good friend Walter de Sans? Why? Who is Walter de Sans? A great warrior? Walter? A warrior? No. He is Count Odo's family priest. He's begging Odo to give us more wine. Huh? We plan to be passed out drunk by the time the Northmen bust into here. Odo's priest might lead me to Odo. But I need to sneak past these guards to the servant's wing. Must be blocked from the other side. Oh my the Count will not attend to you, I will never know. The mother. Pardon me, but is that food for Count Odo? No, this is for Lady Theodorat, his wife. She lies at death's door. And who are you in such garb? A healer, from Frisia. What happened to the lady? While helping wounded soldiers off the walls, she took an arrow in the belly. Persuade that worthless priest Walter to give her the last rites if you can. He's just upstairs. I will see what I can do. Thank you. Oh, my lady. Why the Count will not attend to you, I will never know. The mother of his children, to think it's so stubborn at Odo, and that pathetic Walter du Sens, too drunk to give last rites, but travesty that means.
Pardon me, father. Where's Count Odo? Oh, Odo? His foolish pride will kill us all! Yes, but where is he? Who are you again? No, I can tell you nothing without more wine. Ah, oh, my memory has gone all hazy. Here is your wine. Now, do you remember where is Count Odo? Wine? Ah, sweet, precious wine. The water of lies, the blood of Christ, the fiery flame of the world! Red wine, nothing more. You may have it. Oh, heaven hears my prayer. Now, I can die. Before you do, where is Count Odo? Although, I do not know. But his wife lies wounded in their master bedroom. She may have answers. On the second story, Along the main hall. Here, take the key. I lock the door. Thanks. I should head to Oro's bedroom. I see nothing but shapes. Father, will you hear my confession? Oh, yes. I am the priest, your ladiness. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. In my own pride, I went to battle without armor. Thinking God would be my shield, and now I'm dying, and I will never see my sweet children again. Where are they, Father? Are they safe? They uh, are safe with that good man, Walter Dussan. Do not fear. Thank you. But, Father, please, will you carry a message from a dying woman to her beloved husband? I will, my dear. What should I tell Count Dodo? That he is a good man. That he must live for our children's sake. For Paris. For Francia. He must not die for a mad king. I promise I will do this, good lady. Where may I find your husband? <coughs> Odo remains locked in his sanctum. His sanctum? Up the landing and across the hall. My husband still hopes Charles will ride forth and save the city. Locked in, you said? There is a key 
in the bureau. Take it. Help my husband a any way you can. Death creeps upon me now. Slow and quiet. Like a shadow at day's end. Lord. Your lady wife lies dying. Go to her. Your duty as a husband. My duty is here. When Charles and his army arrive, we will join the attack. We will crush the heathens between the hammer of Charles and the anvil of Paris. <gasps> Leave, Walter. Go comfort my wife as best you can. God, it seems, has chosen a different fate for me. The priest is right. Lay down your arms. Save your city. Among the Northmen, is not death in battle the best way to die? Come, share a glass of wine with a doomed man. I have heard many a warrior cry out for their mothers as their life's blood feeds the ground. I no longer can say if this is the best way to die. Your wife's wound is severe, an arrow to the gut. I saw her. I fear she won't last the night. And I won't last the next quarter of an hour. She's said to be strong for your children. Do not throw away your life for a mad king. Look at these works of stained glass. Delicate. Priceless. Evro's artisans spend years crafting each piece. Wondrous works. I grant you that. We brought them here for safekeeping. In the hopes that your invading horde won't smash them to pieces. You tell me to surrender my city? Abandon my honor? You tell me to live out my days as Siegfried's prisoner? What would you do? I would fight. And someday I will die with steel in my hand. This I know. It is my doom. But today is not that day. And if I put you on your back, bleeding out and crying for your mother? My mother is already dead. Come, no!
Do not make me slay you. Honor demands one of us die. Fine blade for a fine warrior. You fought well, Count Odo, but not well enough. Give me a quick death. Do not make a spectacle of my defeat. Those are not Siegfried's horns. Shar and his army. He arrives in time to save the city. I do not fight. I see a flag of truce. Siegfried and Charles will hold Pale. I must be there. My voice must be heard. As should I. But I am your prisoner. Then I release you on your honor and trust you to keep our truce. Thank you, Eivor. I shall. Lord Siegfried, I offer a gift of silver as a token of the love and friendship between us. Let us have peace. 